pertains to the weather delay, we're still waiting on official verbiage. But uh, the, the match has been called uh, in conjunction, in consul consultation with the referee, um, the match official, um, the stadium officials of Major League Soccer. Um, the match will finish as a 1-1 draw after 65 minutes. Um, Matko, could you just give us a few quick thoughts about the game? Okay, obviously we're a little disappointed when they didn't get the game in the entirety, but, you know, such as... Uh... We can't control the Lord above. But um, look, I thought on the night the guys were, it, it's a d difficult night to play. You, know, you got rain, you got wind, you got starts, you got stops. Um, the one key thing is, you know, we went down a goal. We had a good response. We scored within three minutes to tie it. Um, I felt, you know, if the game went on, I felt we could have pulled three points out on the night. But such is the night. Um, but I give our guys a lot of credit. They fought hard and a lot of adversity. I thought our focus was good. I thought we came out, you know, even with the start, stop stuff. And, the guys came out and they, they kept their focus to try and get three points on the night. Unfortunately, uh, we, we ended up with a draw, but we'll get re uh, reevaluate and go back at it and uh, get ready for Toronto. What? Did you agree with the decision to, to call a game? Yeah, if you look at the radar, there's not much we can do. I mean, the cell's coming from, like, it's moving from the south to the north, and if you really take a look at it, the band is kind of going straight through and not really moving east to west. So, you know, you got to difficult situation. I think the league probably made the right decision. And with the new rules, with the lightning detectors, every 30 minutes you have to wait if there's a strike. So we just had one at 9.05. I think Leo was watching the, in the, on the radar in there. And so every 30 minutes. And so there were some ordinances with the village as well, how late we can start the game and all those types of things. So I think on the night is probably the right decision. Seth? Right, what, what can you guys do to create more goal scoring opportunities for yourself? Yeah. Yeah. Can you repeat? Because I, I, I didn't hear you at the end what you said. What, what, what we can you do to create more goal scoring opportunities? Goal more score opportunities? Yeah. Oh, I think we create a couple of good chances tonight. I think we have a lot of mobility. The team tried to play from the first half great soccer at great speed against the win. Don't forget the win. And the Dragon Keeper made a couple of good saves. Uh, we missed a couple of passes, final passes at the end because uh, for the wet. For the, the the field was so so quick, and uh, Houston tried to put a uh, good pressure, but Grazini made a good chance. Uh, Oduro, uh, he wasn't a, a really chance, but but was was almost for to take his his chance uh, for a score. I think we we are we were very aggressive. I think we if we keep going in, in this game, I think we were winning the game because uh, you can see in the second half. We always want to play, and Houston, they want to keep the ball down, the goalkeeper don't replace the ball quick, they fall down one player, two players. I think we, we create uh, good chances in the first half against the win, and then for sure in the last 20 minutes, we were going to do more chances. We're just going to take one more question. Jeff, I just want you guys to have access to get to the players. What were your guys' uh, impressions of Friedrich with his first uh, regular season game with the club? We were so happy. All team is happy. He's here. A uh, long time he didn't play. He did a great job for us for the first game. For sure, he's going to improve better and better. But his talent quality is not only limited uh, as a soccer player, as a man, as another teammate in this group. Uh, he organized good the defense. And, and, and he's, another, he's another player who come to help this beautiful group we have. And uh, help the, now Corey gives his injury, but we miss him too, as a man too. But the most important is uh, Arne uh, is back, and for sure he's going to give more and better uh, opportunity for to play and for to help the team for sure. Thanks, guys.